Welcome. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to graph this line by using our x and y intercept method. Now remember, when dealing with the x and y intercept method, the main important thing is what we're going to want to do is determine what the x-intercept is and what the y-intercept is. And what I talked about in my previous video is that the x-intercept is when your y value is equal to 0, and your y-intercept is when the x value is equal to 0. When you look at a graph um, of a line, you can see that those intercepts have those values. So what I'll just write that out again. So the y-intercept is when x equals 0, and the x-intercept is when y equals 0. Now what I'm going to do is plug in those values, plug in those values for 0 into both the, for both of these variables. So if x equals 0, I'll have, let's put that in as green. So I'll do 0 plus y equals 4. And then the solve for the x-intercept, I'll have x plus 0 in for y equals 4. Now, to be able to solve for this, you can easily see that, well, this one's pretty easy to solve. In this case, my y-intercept is y equals 4. In this case, my x-intercept is x equals 4. So now, to graph this, All we need to do is find the y-intercept, which is going to be on the y-axis. The y-intercept is where the graph crosses the y-axis. So I'll go up four units since it's positive. One, two, three, four. And then since my y-intercept is a positive four, I'm going to go to the right four units on the x-axis. One, two, three, four. Therefore, now I've labeled what the x and the y-intercept are. And now all I need is two points to graph a line. So I'll connect and graph. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you graph a line using your x and y intercepts. Thanks.